Let's look at question number 54. Consider the following actions. Detection of car crash collision which results in the deployment of airbags almost instantaneously. Detection of accidental free fall of a laptop towards the ground which results in the immediate turning off of the hard drive. Detection of tilt of the smartphone which results in the rotation of a display between the portrait and landscape mode. In how many of the above actions is the function of an accelerometer required? Now these kind of questions are particularly from random origin. To answer such kind of questions, UPSC have actually mentioned, you know, the application of science and technology in everyday life. So this is something which is a question that origin that has its origin from everyday life. But to be honest, these kind of questions are very difficult to predict and also they are very difficult to answer because you may require a keen sight of observing all these events happening around us. So this is the kind of question which is not very tough, which is not very difficult, but a non-science student should really be cautious because if they know, if they have heard of these kind of technologies, if they have read about it, then only they should go ahead and answer them. Otherwise, for science students and for otherwise those students who are, uh, you know, having a keen interest in technology, keen interest in the daily developments of technology, they should find this question fairly easy to answer, right? Now, what exactly is an accelerometer? So, I'll take the reference of accelerometer with the help of uh, you know, this uh, instant airbag deployment in the car. I hope this is something which has become a mandatory clause under the Motor Vehicle Act also that every car should be deployed with airbags. I hope all of you know airbags is an important safety feature. The moment when a car detects that the that the car has crashed or collided with any object, it will quickly, if there's a head-on collision particularly, they will quickly deploy the airbags and it will be an important safety feature for the passengers. But how exactly these accelerometers work? How do they detect that there is a change, right? So the phenomena of accelerometer is basically supported by a concept called piezoelectric effect, right? Now piezoelectric effect is a very interesting phenomena where any mechanical stress, any kind of change or in the mechanical stress on an object is recorded in a form of generating, generating current. So when we define piezoelectric effect, we call it electric electricity generated due to mechanical stress. Right. So the moment when the car crashes into an obstacle, there is a sudden fall of speed. There is a sudden fall of you know, um, in, uh, there is sudden fall of acceleration, and this kind of mechanical change is eventually recorded, and an accelerometer quickly sends a stimuli that the car has stopped, and that can trigger the deployment of the airbags. In the same way, when you look at the second point, that is automatic turning off of the hard drives and laptops whenever there is an accidental free fall. Now, this is also a feature that is found in say, several, uh, you know, uh, laptops which were supporting hard disk drive. Nowadays, we have the solid state drive, but hard disk drive was also quite popular a few years ago. Even today, many laptops comes up with this feature where the moment if an, ac if, if an accidental free fall happens in a laptop, a laptop hard drive automatically turns off, saving the entire data from getting lost. Right. This is also being detected only through accelerometers because they detect that there is a sudden change in the in the movement of the of the laptop, sudden change in the mechanical stress, and that creates the stimuli current for accelerometer to turn off the hard drive. And the same concept now works in the modern smartphones. You guys must have noticed that when you tilt the phone, it basically switches from a portrait to landscape or landscape to portrait mode. Now, this is also detected in the same feature by using the same kind of mechanical stress principle, piezoelectric effect, and accelerometers are used in this application as well. It's a direct application-based question, does not involve a very sophisticated understanding of science, but yes, a keen interest in knowing what is happening in the everyday life is something which is necessary to answer these kind of questions. And the answer to this is option C. All three of them are correct. I hope you guys understood the answer.